Hello and welcome to Reema's Garden. I am Reema Gopalan. So, in this video, we will be discussing about indigenous plants. Now, what are indigenous plants? Have you heard this word a lot? So, what happens is these kind of words are thrown at us, indigenous, native and all that. So, what it basically means is, indigenous plants are native plants, local plants. Um, so, how would you know? Um, see, any plant that has by default grown here um, in India or the Indian subcontinent, South Asia would be called as a native plant or an indigenous plant. Whereas a plant um, that belongs to say uh, Europe, okay, that will be called as a exotic plant. Now the definition reverses. If you are staying in Europe, the plants that are native to Europe will be called as indigenous plants. So please understand this term is a relative term. So when we use it, we mean the plants that grow naturally in our habitat. Now how do we identify uh, what are the indigenous plants and how to go about it? I give a very uh, simple uh, base parameter. If you are opting for any kind of plant and you know its name in some local language, regional language, it's an indigenous one. Like if you say rose, you will know gulab. When you say chrysanthemum, you will know whether you call it guldaudi or shevanti or jamandi, you know uh, the words in local languages. So any plant that you know a local name to. 99% is a native plant and another 1% it has got acclimatized here. It has been in India uh, or the Indian subcontinent for over 400, 500 thousand years and it has got uh, acclimatized here. So beginner's tip, if you are starting out, start with indigenous plants and then slowly go for the exotic ones. Thank you.